Hey, it's me, GV, and welcome back to Let's Play Skyrim Anniversary Edition. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're wondering why things just pause there for a second, well, that's because I alt-tab to start my timer. Uh, welcome back. We are doing the Anniversary Edition content, and let's take a look at what we've got. A soul divided. I have encountered the Guardian once more, only this time he was empowered with dark magic. Once again, upon nearing defeat, he vanished, and the vault reacted to this magic. I should return to the sword chamber to see if more of his vault has now become accessible. Uh, I know what we get from this. You might not know what we get from this. And actually, this is a pretty in-depth uh, thing here, because, like, there was a new quest, I guess, that was gotten from this. So I have to make sure that we discover everything. Thank you. Uh, let's see. So, yeah, because we didn't explore the other tomb too much. There's all these skeletons as well. Let's look here. Void salt. Ooh. Uh, barrel, 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 barrel. Hey, look, I'm PewDiePie. Barrel. <laughs> Remember that? No? God, I'm old now. Holy crap. Remember that? When PewDiePie used to say barrel? No? All right. Um, let's just make sure we got everything, and let's check the other chamber as well. Woohoo! I don't like how you can't jump at the same time. Smuggler. Pot. More barrels. They wouldn't hide something in a random barrel. I at least would hope so. Would hope not. Okay. Yeah, I wasn't really fully exploring because I didn't think there would be anything, but there in fact was. So let's hop down here. And then that takes us back, but what if we go down here? Is there anything? Oh my gosh, this just keeps going and going and going and going and going. Smuggler, pickaxe, cooked catfish, gold and a lockpick. We'll eat that cooked catfish real quick. Okay, what about down here? Hello? Anything? Anything at all? Oh, we've got some water skellies. It's a rare water type skelly. Cursed smuggler. Okay, we've got a barrel there with something in it. Frost Miriam. We've got a door here with a guild ma- Look at this! Guild Mage's warning. I warned them to be cautious. No matter how perfect the incantation, magic is the husband of chaos. We let our guard down, and this abomination is the result of our hubris. And to make matters worse, he has divided into three. Divines help us all. Potion of minor healing. Looks like that didn't help them out too much. Gold, potion of vigorous stamina, and a steel great sword. Yeah, that man, this one really has a lot of detail put into it. Curse smuggler. Boop. Uh, do you guys have anything interesting? Ancient Nord Warhammer. Okay, I'm gonna assume that's it for this part, but we did not explore the uh, first chamber, so let's do that when we head back. Flawless Amethyst, Gold, Grand Soul Gem, Silver Ingot, and a Silver Ruby Ring. Let's put this away. Huh. I've been listening to Daft Punk's Random Access Memories, which is a fantastic album. My girlfriend bought it for me, a double vinyl, for Christmas. And I just found out today, because I finally got to the second side of it, that the... Uh, uh, which one did we already... I think we explored this one that they duplicated it. I, they gave me two vinyls with the same... They basically gave me... If you don't know, a double vinyl is like, you know, basically exactly what it sounds like. Open the route. Wait, wait, where do we... Where is that other one? I think to the left here. Uh, yeah, red first, then... Yeah, that's the next one. Um, yeah, so they duplicated it. They basically gave me, gave me two vinyls that are the same vinyl, which really sucks, actually, because now I can't listen to the second half of Random Access Memories on vinyl, which I really, really like. So, yeah, that sucks. Smuggler, gold, old smuggler's note. Look at this. Damn these mages with their magic. Things were good here. Yeah? Life was sweet and profits were plenty before the boss agreed to help these fools with their trap. This venture will cost us the shirts off our back, I'll wager. Uh, not just that, buddy. It'll cost you far more than that. Uh, let's see. Yeah, there's so much detail put into every little square inch of this place. The little notes and everything. I'm not used to this, which is why we didn't, uh, explore every little nook and cranny. Uh, we can probably jump over there. I don't know if that's supposed to be intentional or not. To be able to get over there, but we can definitely do it. With the power of whirlwind sprint. 
So let's see if we can find any little secrets over here. I mean, yeah. Looks like there may be. Door with a novice lock. Look at this. Yeah, there, there needs to be more whirlwind sprint puzzles. I would be definitely down with that. Skeleton. Gold guild mages. No, look at this. How could this have happened? Our plan should have worked, but who could foresee that this weapon would interfere with our simple enchantments? And now we have become ensnared in our own trap. What is this weapon and what does it herald? I guess they never played Oblivion, huh? Potion of Plentiful Magicka. We've got a chest with black soul gem, flawless sapphire, gold refined moonstone, silver emerald necklace. Anything else in here? Snowberries. And that is about it. Uh, just for the heck of it, I'm going to try to jump over to this too. Whoa! Yeah, I didn't expect that one to work. Okay, yeah, some of you might know what weapon is in the middle there. Um, that thing right there. I'll take a close look at it for a second. Definitely remember what that is for me personally. I mean, I should. It's literally one of my favorite, if not my favorite weapon in all of Elder Scrolls. Okay, let's go. Hello. What do we have in here? Guild Mage, Bone Meal. Guild Mage, Bone Meal, Potion, Minor Stamina. Guild Mage, two gold. And, oh my god, there's so many. Okay, let's check the room first and foremost. Uh, open door? The door's control... Okay. Huh, I wonder what that's gonna mean. The door's controlled elsewhere. Hmm. Uh, it would be bad game design to hide a note in all of these random skeletons, but I'm gonna check anyways. Okay, well, this one makes sense. I guess it's the closest to the thing. Guild Mage's missive. We have to try to contain him or die trying. She is the key to everything for her death defied him, defined him, and drove him insane. Perhaps we can use her remains to summon her spirit and calm him. Interesting. Use her remains. Elves ear, gold, spell tome bound, sword, gold. Uh, where is her remain? Oh, hi. Okay, this guy's just chilling. Hello. Where's her remains? Uh, Lavender, Touch, Tomb of the Guardian's Wife, Salonis' Journal, Volume 1. Hopefully didn't, we didn't miss Volume 2, because we found 3. I'm not sure where 2 is, though. Our guild has been commissioned to capture and restrain a renegade blade's captain. Many tall tales have been spoken of his cruelty and malice, some even claiming he is part serpent. In addition to bearing the arms of his former employers, it is said that he wields an Akaviri weapon of dark magic. The combination makes him quite formidable. Thankfully, the guild has great experience in dealing with such things, and we will win the day. We encountered our foe. But all did not go as planned, and he escaped us. He was more powerful than we had imagined, and many lives were lost as a result of our misjudgment. However, I am now convinced that his dreaded blade is the source of his power, as I have witnessed firsthand the dark magic it yields, where the blade drinks both life force and mana from any that befall it. We must think of a way to separate our foe from the source of his power. We have devised a means to separate our foe from his blade, and we must now set a trap and lure him to us. I am certain that it will work, but to be sure, I must think of an incentive to draw him to us. I think it would be prudent to research this former captain in more depth. Upon reading what I have regarding our captain, my heart almost feels pity for him. It would seem that his madness and malice stem from the loss of his wife. The records reveal that it was after this tragic event that the darkness of the soul overcame him. However, pity will not save lives. He must be stopped in all event. Therefore, I have decided to acquire the remains of his loved one in the hope that this will draw him to us. Okay, so Tomb of the Guardians. So I guess this is, yeah, this is the remains here. Investigate the East Chamber. Oh my god! So Skelly shouldn't be that big of a deal, right? Yeah. Okay. Let's go, Mort. Me and you, buddy. Hello. Boop. Hello. Boop. Hello. Boop. Hello. Ah. Who is shooting me with magic, by the way? Oh, here we go. Okay. Um, let's make sure to heal. Let's do Oak Flesh. Okay, let's do... Fast Healing. And let's do one of these. Ooh, big one. Okay, let's go. The Guardian. Okay, 
Okay, not sure what's happening at the moment. Oh, now he's green. Okay, let's make sure not to die. I think if we die here, that's going to be pretty bad. Of course, it's going to be pretty bad, but I'm saying we'll go back a far amount. Yeah, anytime someone's using magic, it's always scary. Let's get rid of these guys. Yay. Let's go. Gonna get unrelenting force back here in a second. Watching my HP. Down he goes. Gonna use fast healing. Now we have, I'm assuming, the blue version? The blue version. Oh, look, he's raising. Oh, that's. How about no? Oh, now he's pretty strong, it seems. See ya! Laurent Bouchard. Okay. Now he's corporeal. Um, yeah, let's do Ancestor's Wrath. Let's do Oak Flesh again. And let's go for it. I can do this all day, Laurent Bouchard. Oh, you can use the voice, huh? Good for you. But you gotta get some attacks in here if you're gonna kill me, buddy. Pretty cool death animation for somebody that is supposed to be evil. Return to the sword chamber. We have Laurent Bouchard, who has a blades sword, a blades shield, a letter from home. My dearest Laurent, I know that there is no power that will stop them from taking you away from me and into battle upon foreign fields, for I understand that this is your duty as a captain of the blades. As your wife, I should respect such things. Nevertheless, the fear that you may never return troubles me. Know that I think of you always. We are bound together in this life and in the next. Your beloved, Emma. It'd be cool if after you read that, she actually came alive and started attacking you. Uh, we'll take the blade set as well, even though I'm pretty sure that's the same set as, uh, same set as the, um, 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 um you know, well, I guess I, uh, there's another blade set in the game, basically is what I'm saying. Ooh. Whoa, look out. Okay, that's super cool. That is super cool. Man, what a good quest this was. Take Dawn Fang. Dawn Fang added. Retrieve the sword. I'm assuming that completes the quest as well. Completed. Retrieve the sword. Completed a soul divided. Okay, let's take a look at it. So, Dawn Fang, Dusk Fang, for those that don't know, is from... Ooh, I wonder how this is done, too. Dongfang and Duskfang, for those that don't know, is from the Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion, the Shivering Isles expansion. Uh, probably my favorite weapon in the entirety of the Elder Scrolls series. Uh, this one's super cool. Let's read it. In daytime, deals 7 points of fire damage. At night, deals 7 points of frost damage. After killing 12 creatures, absorbs 5 points of health or magicka. Zero creatures killed. So I'm going to favorite this and put this on my right hand. And yeah, it looks exactly like... Ooh, it's got a moving sigil, too. Was there anything else to explore here, by the way? Yeah, very cool. Yeah, so it looks exactly like the Oblivion version. Um, how the Oblivion version worked is basically... Yeah, I, I, I'm assuming it's 12. What was that? John the Fist. I'm assuming it's 12. I don't actually remember. Valonis? Salonis's Confession? What is this? My son, I do not have long for this world, but before the winter night embraces me, I would confess a great regret that has burdened my heart for many years. Long ago, my brethren and I were commissioned to hunt down and ensnare a dark and powerful renegade captain, a man who, once a proud soldier, had become corrupted by a powerful artifact and turned to great darkness of deed. We fulfilled our commission, but not without great cost, for I alone managed to survive the encounter. But in the many years that have followed this venture, I have often wondered if our deed in ensnaring him was equally evil. For with our combined enchantments, we have bound him to an eternity of misery, for we bound him to the guardianship of the very thing that drove him insane, the artifact. A powerful weapon that now, despite his yearning for it, he cannot we not yield while he lives. Wait, not yield while he lives. It is a cruel fate for a once great man, for he was just that until grief and anger laid him bad to such utter corruption and malice. That story is a sad tale indeed. 
But now, these many years on, my heart sees the truth, and I would undo that which was done and free him from his misery. But alas, it is too late for me to take on such a quest. Therefore, I pray that you, my son, will do this task in my stead. I beg you as a father's last wish, seek him out and set him free. Your father, Salonis. Okay, so this was his son, Velonis, who is also... Are you serious? What just happened? What was that? What the? How did he deal that much damage to me? What? Because I'm at full health here. Now let's read this again. How did he? What the heck? Seriously, how did he deal that much damage? To me? Okay. Good on you. You got the drop on me, buddy. But it's not gonna happen twice. Ale, gold, venison shop, ring of recuperation. Stamina regenerates 20. Why does he have this? Gloves of the Pugilist. Unarmed strikes do 10 additional damage. Yeah, we all know what that is. Why the heck did that guy deal that much damage to me? That was weird. And this must be the Skeever. Unlocked with Skeever Cage Cube. We've got Scritch. Hello. Come with me. Okay, we'll go with the Skeever for a little bit. Uh, looks like he was fed some dogs. Gross. Empty skooma bottle. Uh, we'll take an empty scuba bottle in case that's unique. Doesn't really matter, though. If there's two of it, it's not really unique. So anyways, as I was saying, um... Also, how the heck... Also, I was saying, um... So yeah, this, uh, this weapon works the same in Oblivion. Where you will, uh, kill, I believe it is, 12 souls... And then it turns into Dawn Fang. So basically, if it's Dawn Fang, which should be the daytime one, right? Um, and you kill 12 people within the day, it'll turn into Dusk Fang Superior at night. And it dealt, like, cold damage, if I remember right. Um, and then if you kill, like, 12 people, it'll turn into Dawn Fang Superior the next time, which will deal extra damage. It, it wasn't, like, that good, if I remember right, but it was... Very, very, very cool. And if you know me, I like the cool stuff, not the good stuff, necessarily. So, very, very, very neat. Very neat indeed. Um, Alright, I'm going to tell Scritch to... Go find food. Interesting. Go find food. Buying and selling fine jewelry I here. I wonder what he does. How far does he go? I like skeevers, you know? I've had rats in real life, like, quite a lot of rats as pets. Uh, skeevers, if they're not so aggressive... Is he literally just going to, like, steal food or something? What the heck? You good? Wait for me at home. Mmm... Golden Hills Plantation. Pet will be waiting at the specified location. All right, let's do so. I know we just did some of this, but let's do some inventory management. I want to get rid of my... Now, since this uh, playthrough has become more in the main light of the channel, I want to make sure that we've got some good stuff going. So we've got our Unicord here. Um, yeah, you know what? It's weird. I, I do feel like all of this Creation Club content is a little bit immersion-breaking. Um, some of the stuff fits right at... Wait, what? Is it blue now? Wait, why is this... What time is it? Oh, yeah. We traveled, so it's blue now. Oh, very, very, very cool. Very cool indeed. Very cool. Very cool indeed. Anyway, since this playthrough is in the mainstream now for this channel, I want to... Um, I want to make sure that we have all of our equipment and stuff set. Gloves of the Pugilist. Ring of Recuperation. Stamina regenerates 20% faster. I think we can disenchant this. Gloves of the Pugilist, we can disenchant as well, because we can then put this on something else, although this is unique, so I don't really want to disenchant it, to be honest with you. Alrighty, then. Let's go to our weapon chest. We will drop off any unique weapons, such as the blade sword, such as... Uh, let's see. Gold brand, which I will unfavorite and drop off. Gold brand's obviously excellent, but... If we're using one-handed sword, I want it to be one of my favorites. Um, iron dagger, we gotta drop that. K 
Okay, does this barrel have anything? Empty. Large sack. These are all of our notes. Let's go to books and drop off any notes. X to store, right? The reason I say that is because... Uh... I've been playing a lot of Fallout 4 on the Twitch channel. And... I've been playing a lot of Fallout 4 on the Twitch channel and, like, you know, the buttons are different for storing and stuff. Um... Also, it's. I just wanted to mention how cool it is that Skyrim actually has different note assets. Like, if you look to the right, like, this note looks like this, but some notes will look different. Like, that's a nice little, you know, nice little detail that Skyrim does. It's pretty cool, actually. It's pretty cool, actually. Peter. Boop and boop and boop. Good. And here is all of our sellables, so we do that last. Wardrobe, apparel, amulet of Mara, blades, armor, boots, gauntlets, helmet, shield. Gloves of the Pugilist, shield of solitude we're using. And then we drop that off. Okay. Weapons. No weapons. I guess we'll drop off the iron dagger here, though. Apparel. Uh, boop and boop. Podions. I think I went through these already. Uh, did I not go through it when we had to reload? I think I did. Scrolls we did, food, poisoned, sliced goat cheese. Have to remember to drop that off. Uh, I will eat the slaughter fish, because we don't, eh, maybe we need it, I don't know. Ingredients, do we have any unique ingredients here? Let's see. Uh, we do have a lot of the new ingredients from the um, goldfish. It's an ingredient, not an actual fish, weird. Heart of order. Oh, but I'm not storing unique stuff here. Yes, no. Books, keys, miss. Okay, any gems in here? Uh, boop, 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 boop. And... Do, 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 do. Refined Amber, gotta drop that off too. Statue of Bella. Good. Okay, the only question is, where the heck did I put all of my books? Did I just not do that? I definitely... What the hell was that noise? Oh, the Bone Hound. Yeah, cool. Uh, where did I put the books? There's like a bookshelf, right? Oh, here we go. Take Spell Tome, Conjure Zombie Reality, and other falsehoods. Activate bookshelf. You place 11 more books on the shelf. Okay, here we go. Books. Uh, store, right? Yeah. Uh, I'm just gonna go down. Store, 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 store. Crypt of the Heart Draft. I have no idea what that is. Can't place that many books on the shelf. That's fine. Ooh, cool. Activate bookshelf. You can store eight more books on the shelf. Okay. Books. Let's see. Boop, 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 and good. Love how that looks. Okay, cool. Uh, let's see. Any other books? Do we have other bookshelves? Like, where did I... Whatever. It's fine. Okay, last thing is misc items over here. In the misc chest. This will just be our misc chest and our uh, unique chest as well. Weapons done. Apparel done. Podions. Do we have any potions that are unique? I feel like we did. Could be wrong, though. Scrolls. Any unique scrolls? Food. Any unique food? Yes. Poison slice. Goat cheese. Salmon, slaughterfish, veggie soup, ingredients. Okay, any unique ingredients? Yeah, we have the Heart of Order, right? Heart of Order. Human Heart. Store that. Uh, I want to store all of these Oblivion stuff, but I'm not going to remember which one's which, to be honest. Nern Root. We do have quite a lot of these. Okay, Void Essence, Wheat, Worm's Head Cap, Books. Shouldn't be no books, Keys, Misk, and then finally Misk. Camping Supplies. Gonna keep that, although it doesn't this way anything. Build a campsite when outdoors. Doesn't really matter, so we'll store that. Empty Skooma Bottle. Lexicon, Map Wild Horses, Meridius Beacon, Bunch of Soul Gems, Refined Amber, Soul Tomato, Soul Tomato, Boop, and Boop. And we are good. Inventory cleaned out. Final thing. Items, ingredients. Look to the top left. See if any of these things we have not eaten. Just to clear out a few more ounces. Hanging moss of carry weight. 
uh, spade fish, which I'm not gonna eat. I'm not gonna eat any fish because I forget which fish we need for the quests. Okay, and there we go. Now, final thing. Um, we're gonna go to magic, and we're gonna go to all, and we're gonna unfavorite anything that I'm not gonna be using. So, Ancestor's Wrath, we are favorited. Bound Sword, we are unfavoriting because I'm gonna use Dawn Fang now. Yeah. Unfortunately, we lose out on some conjuration, but that's fine. Uh, Conjurfowl, Zombie. Oh. Ooh, Apprentice, level Adept, Golden Saint. Yeah, let's get one of these guys. All right, we're going to say goodbye to Mort for now, but uh, I'll never forget him. We might summon him again. We'll just see. Golden Saint Archer, Golden Saint Warrior, Skeleton Champion, Zombie. Uh, adept, 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 cost 18, 18, 47. Summons a Skeleton Champion that gains plus 10% attack damage for each nearby enemy. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Let's summon these guys uh, for now. We'll do a Conjure Golden Saint Warrior. Elemental Bolt is our go-to destruction. Fast healing, of course. Oak Flesh, yes. Soul Split, no. Uh, that was cool, but I'm going to take that off. Steadfast Ward. People always ask me why I don't use wards. I've just never played with wards. That's basically it. And it's like it's... I always have something in my left and right hand, and it's annoying having a ward out, if that makes sense. Strangulation, goodbye. Unrelenting Force and Whirlwind Sprint. Okay, and there we go. We are fully stocked up. Uh, I know that's boring for some, but I know it's also interesting for some as well to watch. So I hope you fall into the interesting camp of, like, you know, basically wanting to see all that. Uh, we're going to do Dusk Fang in the right hand and Conjure Golden Saint Warrior in the left hand. And then, finally, let's go to skills because we have a perk point. Uh, what the heck are we even focusing on here? Uh, I think the order of operations is going to be one-handed first. Okay, so we need 80 for this. Do we have anything up here? Bone Breaker. Oh, yeah, we're trying to go maces. Dang it. We went, well, whatever. It's not that big of a deal. Critical charge, one-handed power attack while sprinting. I never, ever, ever do that. Okay, so one-handed is done. Then let's go... Oh, yeah, we're doing pickpocket, which is such a waste of perks. Let's be real. Forgot we were klepto in this one. Uh, okay, that's fine. Speech, alchemy, illusion, conjure. Yeah, let's do conjuration after that. Novice. Summoner. Okay, we got the adept. Good. Necromancy. Okay, not much there. Uh, destruction, I guess, will be next. What is this? Rune Master? Nah, not gonna use runes. Okay. And then we've got Restoration. Cast Apprentice level Restoration. Spells for half magical. What's this? Magic regenerates 25% faster? Oh, hell yeah. Forgot about that one. Cool. Alright, now, uh, we are going to go do another quest that is a part of Anniversary Edition. We are going to do search my brain for where this is. Uh, we are going to Solitude. We're going to pick up some attitude in Solitude. That doesn't make any sense. The hell did I just say? Alright. This feels good. We feel all... I feel all good. I feel all cleaned out. Not physically, but I mean like... I feel like our character is like, you know doing pretty you know what i mean anyways seems there's always more to be done seems like always yesterday life became blah, 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 blah. okay there's supposed to be something in here I, we haven't done it right um there's supposed to be as far as i remember is it like hidden i'm trying to remember what the next thing that i was supposed to be doing is because i'm thinking we didn't do it yet, so there should be, like, some strong box. Okay, let's steal from this real quick. What the heck was the next thing supposed to even be? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I have a vague idea of what it is. I don't think we've done it, so I don't know. I did. I'm basically trying to go down alphabetically through the list of new content and um, not look too far into it, just so I can obviously be surprised as to what it mainly deals with. But... Usually, the new quests are garnered from... Can you just open? Holy crap. Dude. I <laughs> I absolutely hate it when it's like one pixel and it just won't like do it. Oh my god. How many lockpicks do we have? This is just sad at this point. 
Just open! Stop being like one pick. There's no way. There's no way it's always the There's no way. What? This isn't a. I'm gonna lose my mind. Okay. Jeez Louise. Well, at least it was a decent amount of gold. Uh, biography of Berenzi. Where is this? There should be like something here. Usually yeah, it's like right on the uh, the table. One minute to drag Glad you decided to check us if out. You need a good rumor or two. I think I can oblige. Yeah, I do need a rumor. Am I supposed to ask you? I don't want to get some random crap radiant quest. Is it like on the door? I'm like 99.9% .9 sure we have not done this quest. So I'm just wondering if it's maybe posted to the door out here. And I missed it. No. Yeah, it should be the Winking Skeever. Unless there's another Solitude Inn that I'm forgetting. Castle Dower, Blacksmith. Yeah, there should be a quest that we can pick up here. And uh, usually with the Anniversary Edition content, it's just like on the bar. But it's, I'm not seeing it. All right, let's just get a quest. Maybe he gives you the quest. Hello. Welcome to the Winking Skeever, friend. Heard any rumors lately? I've heard Jari Raz hanging around the Wells District, looking for new blood to hire. Heard any rumors lately? I think the Bard's College might be looking for recruits. You should speak to the head of the college, Viarmo, if you're interested. Heard any rumors lately? People say there's a man wandering the streets near the Blue Palace. He seems distressed, but he's not making any sense. Any bouncy work I can help with? Of course. It's all in this note. Oh, that might be it. Yeah? Bones for a crow? What? I don't think that that is even it. Heard any rumors lately? People say there's someone in Riften that can change your face, make you look completely different. Do you believe that? That's crazy. Do you know where I can find some work? Of course. It's all in this note. Blood in the water. Seems there's always more to be done. If you need a good rumor or two, I think I can oblige. I'm in need of some work. Do you have anything for me? Of course. It's all in this note. Missing... Br okay, we're getting a whole bunch, but not the one... All right. This is weird. Um, I'm going to save here and make sure that we didn't do this already. And I will see you all in the next episode. Thanks so much for watching. Thank you to my patrons and my Twitch subscribers. See you next time.